Okay, Will from WC Review going over the Blue Otter from Tops. As you can see, this is how I received it. I bought it on Amazon. It was, I think, like 90 bucks. Call it 90 bucks. Again, I waited like a little girl. Couldn't wait for the knife to come. Um, I am looking for something, something in a good size that I can carry with me and use. Um, I just reviewed the Operator 7. I love the knife. It was just too damn big. And on the other end of the spectrum, this is just too damn small. But let's go over it. I should have had it up. So let me pull it up. So I can give you guys some specs in case you're interested in it. Okay. Here it is as it came. Here's the, the Kydex sheath. Again, with the... Um, the top's um, belt clip. However, this one doesn't swivel. So you're kind of forced, unless you want to change the screws, which is a pain in the ass, uh, to carry it in this fashion. I was hoping to carry it scout style. I like to carry horizontal. I was hoping to have this on my belt. Right, so here's the knife. It is a very, very nice knife. Hold on. Sorry about that. Just wanted to put it down. Uh, here's the knife. Again, the thing that turned me on was the thick spine on the knife. Uh, the overall, the blade length is three and a half inches. The overall length is six and a quarter. Um, it's 1095, like most, if not all, of the uh, the Topps knives. It's a good looking knife. I was just hoping for something a little bigger. It does not, I have big hands. It's a three finger knife, does not fit very well. Um, again, that rubber band is just there. I can't take it off, but uh, sharp as hell. Good looking knife. Got all the types, the uh, top stuff on it. Again, how thick is it? Does it say? Yes, it's three sixteenths thick. For a little knife like that, that's pretty thick. Uh, uh, again, the fit and function, it's a very well made knife, as are all tops. Um, my negative statements on this are just that it's too small. I was hoping for something bigger. I, I, I should have read up a better because it, it, you know, it didn't give me anything, any misleading facts. I was just, in my mind, had a picture of something bigger. So I'm probably going to send it back, but it's a really good knife. Uh, I would recommend it for people, but if you could see, just so there's no misconceptions. I have fairly big hands, but it's pretty freaking small. Uh, but again, I'm a huge Topps fan. I will definitely be uh, ordering many more Topps knives. It does come with the certificate of authenticity and the um, the survival whistle, which is a little uh, cool little thing, a little, um, I don't know what the word is, but little gimmick that Topps uses. So I have like three or four of, of the whistles already. So that'll probably go back with it. But the Blue Otter from Topps, good knife. Uh, I would say it's a two-star knife out of out of four stars. Uh, for the reasons that I said. But it's fun. It's a good knife. Thanks for listening.